Today, Sunny and I answer the hardest would you rather questions in Roblox. Would you guys rather have toes for fingers or fingers for toes? Comment down below. Sunny, would you rather have big feet or have a big head? Well, you've already got a big head, bro, so we'll take those big feet. All right, bro, you're gonna die, let me tell you. No chance, bro. Look at the size of my feet. I'm gonna stomp that watermelon. Look at the size of my head. I will outbrain you and kill you. There's no chance. You have no brain to begin with. There's only four watermelon seeds inside of that dome. Wait, why don't I have a hammer? Why can't I kill you? Dang it. Only one player has a weapon in this lobby. Oh, wait, no. A bunch of them do. It's just me and you don't have weapons. I don't understand. Please. It's okay, Melon. After this round of Would You Rather ends, I'm making sure I get myself the van hammer. And then I'm gonna slap you like whap, bap, boom. Or goats. I could just do this. Is there actually even anything good here? Sprint. Yeah, I guess running faster would be helpful. For the small price of 500 Robux, I can get the slap. Hey, Sonny! Yo, I won't let you slap me! I'm too quick with it! Get over here! Bro, this thing doesn't even work. What is this? Because I got big feet, I could run fast now. That makes no sense. I'm so confused. It's okay. Hey, yo, you flipped me! Uh, I got him. Anyways, would you rather be a vampire or a werewolf? Ooh, vampires live forever. I'll take that. Uh, I'd rather be a vampire, too. Oh, my goodness! I'm a vampelon! It's time to suck some poop! Oop. Because you would eat poop as a vampire, Melon? I would not eat poop, bro. Come on. Melon, it's time for a new game. Would you rather win a one-day shopping spree to any store or a two-week vacation to any destination? Uh, I'm definitely gonna go with the vacay. No! We got kicked out! But now we can watch them fight, bro. Look at those greedy shoppers. Bro, Loki, the shop might be better. Because then you could go to a bank. Wait a second. You're right. You could go to a shop, get a bunch of really, really, really expensive stuff, and then you could probably afford two-year vacation. These guys are actually idiots. But it looks like blue team is about to die, Sonny. And the squad on the vacation team wins. Speaking of the squad, Melon, I'm gonna take a look at my squad of weapons. Yes, let's see. Let's see. <gasps> a plunger. This is just like Skibbity. Now, Melon, you must pick a side. Would you wrestle with a bull shark or box with a kangaroo? Bro, if you pick wrestle with a bull shark, you're literally dead. And it looks like there's four dead ones. Ow, I just got grapple hooked. No, I'm dead instantly. What was that? Bro, you got grappled to your death. I'm taking out the grappler, though. I'm hitting him with my plungers. That was redonkulous. Kill them all. Yes, we did it. Would you rather have a zombie apocalypse or have an alien invasion? Obviously a zombie apocalypse, bro. An alien invasion means you're dead. They're way more advanced than us. Yeah, but what if they're a friendly alien species? You don't know that. What if they're a friendly zombie species? Okay, well that much we know to be impossible. It's time for you to die, Sonny, with my lightning gun. No, it's time for you to be plunged back to the sewer realm. Die, Sonny! Oh, bro, you're not even touching me. What do you mean? You're like half health. Oh, wait, I am half elf. Die, melon! The aliens shall prevail! Oh, no. You're dead. And now... Oh, we won! Now, would you rather discover something great and spread it, or discover something evil and prevent it? Both of them, you're the hero. But I think I'd rather spread greatness. Yeah, bro, why would you purposely want to just, like, do nothing for the world? Oh, no. What? Why? That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. There is so many people on both teams. It's an all-out war. I've taken out one. Time to take out my second and my third. No, I got grappled. I got grappled. And I got plunged to the face. That's disgusting. That's it. I need to choose a better weapon, like a piano. Bro, what is that? This guy's grapple hook is insane. I'm dead. If it reaches you, you're finished in one hit. I can't believe the evildoers have won. They managed to do nothing for the world. Congratulations. Would you rather punch Jar Jar Binks from Star Wars for a full hour or have a conversation with Yoda for 10 minutes? I love Jar Jar Binks. He's cool. I would personally rather talk to Yoda. Yeah, but if you punch him for an hour, you could also talk to him for one hour. He doesn't know anything, Sonny. He's just a Jar Jar Binks. He's also the Sith Lord, so I don't want to mess with him. Oh, no. I swear if the guy with the grappling hook is on their team. Don't worry, Melon. I'm gonna hit him with a piano! One. I took out the potato man. Ooh! I think we did it. That was epic. We took them all out. And it's time for me to change up my weapons to the Sword of Swords. 
Well, then I shall strike my enemies with lightning in the next round. How's this person in there? I don't know. Melon, would you rather be a roommate with Bob Marley or a roommate with Snoop Dogg? I'm going Bob Marley, dude. That guy was cool. I'm going with Snoop Dogg because that guy is cool. Dude, Snoop Dogg's alive. You could actually do that right now. You can't do that with Bob Marley. Yeah, but I, I can't do that with Snoop Dogg either. I have a feeling most people don't know who Bob Marley is. Never mind, they do! What do you mean? You're dead, bro. You got three teammates. No! Kill him! Hit him with the E! E! You're actually broken. Did I kill anybody? I gotta take you out, Melon. You're too powerful. Come on, die! Ow! You almost killed me with that thing. Yes, I can do it! I'm dead! Finally, I struck you down. Half my team was AFK. Yeah, and now they're coming to kill me because my lightning isn't doing anything. Oh, I know. My lightning's wrecking them. I just gotta go near them. Got him. Oh, no. I got caught in her sword. It summons in vines or something weird. I think it's time I spend a little bit of Robux to get a more powerful weapon. The Chaos Edge. For 10,000. Yes, please. Guys, I'm gonna try buying the grapple hook. I wanna see how this thing is. Sonny, would you rather $5 a day for the rest of your life or 50,000 right here, right now? Oh, 50,000 right here, right now. $5 a day is not enough. Yeah, bro. I'm going with the 50K. Do you know the price of milk these days? Uh-oh. Grapple. Got him! Bro, the grapple hook's insane! These people are fools! Come on! Oh, I'm using my ultimate abilities on them! And I wrecked two of people! Oh my- Oh, I'm dead. I don't know what happened. At the very start, our entire arena was on fire and I couldn't move. That might have been my fault. I had an awesome flame blade. Bro, and you used it on your team. No, I didn't. I, uh, just whipped it out by accident. I need to find a cooler weapon like this. Because I'm really strong and muscular, so now I will lift weights in the arena. Would you rather be a fairy who cannot fly, or be a 10-foot tall dwarf? Uh, I'll be a 10-foot tall dwarf. But can you use, like, fairy magic and not fly if you choose this one? Oh, no, I didn't think about that. Oh, but it doesn't matter. Dwarf squad! I'm gonna hit you with my big weights! I'm not afraid! Okay, I'm afraid. I'm afraid. I just put you in my special ability, Sonny. Now, ban! How do you have a special ability? Actually, this sword is so overpowered. That's not even funny. Yeah, I died really fast. Yeah, Special ability activated! Melon, how do you know if you have a special attack? It says it. Oh. And we killed your entire team. Whatever, I need a bigger sword. You're going down in this next fight. We'll see about that. Unless we're on the same team. Well, Sonny, that all depends. Would you rather work for 10 hours a day for days a week? Or work 8 hours a day, 5 days a week? I'm gonna go with the four days a week. No, I didn't pick anything. I was still thinking. Oh no, that is a big squad I've got to face. Activate my ability! Bro, you literally put everyone on fire. Oh no, it's not enough. It's not enough! You lit everyone on fire and still lost. Bro, there was like 18 of them. Would you rather be 21 years old forever or be 10 years old forever? 100% rather be 21 years old forever. Are you sure about that? If you're 10 year old, everything's really fun because you just use your imagination a lot. Yeah, but that's how that works, bro. You're gonna be bored and just in a tiny little 10 year old body. Okay, fine. Let me get this one. No, it's too slow again. Well, Sonny, I still didn't get to see your ability. Uh, I suck. All right, on the next one, I will destroy you for sure. Come on, kill them all, kill them all, kill them all. There's no way you win this. I can, if I use my ability appropriately. Q, 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 special ability, special ability, please. I'm wrecking this noob, noob down. Wait, we're actually about to win. We're about to win. And we did it, Sonny. Melon, you're just lucky I can't purchase a custom side. What does that even mean? Don't worry about it. Would you rather be a morning person or be a night, night owl? Yeah, not a night owl, a night owl. Personally, I'd rather do this. Well, I know you're a morning person, so I'm gonna take the night owl so that I can destroy you! Are you sure about that? I hope so, because I want to destroy you. Well, let's see, Sonny. Which blade is stronger? Wait, what? It's a grapple hook fight? <laughs> I don't need a blade. I just need to drag you to your doom. Oh, no. I messed up. I messed up. Wait for it. Wait for it. No! He's done for. This is it, Melon. The final battle. Would you rather eat a Big Mac burger every six hours or eat an exquisite meal once every four days? Wow, I'm taking that exquisite meal, of course. Well, if you're choosing exquisite, I'm choosing fast food because I will eat one McDonald's burger every day. Actually, you're eating a Big Mac four times a day. Oh, yeah, you're right. I'm going to be huge. Bro! 
look at me. Fight me, Melon. Fight me. Die, Sonny. I've trapped you and now I set you aflame. Wait, I can't even use this sword. It's not swinging. How do I swing it? You must be stronger. And you're dead. I should have lifted more weights. And you goats can lift our channel up by subscribing right now. Today, Sunny and I are taking on My Weird Strict Dad Chapter 3. But this time, I vow to beat it. This is by far the hardest chapter because there's so many things you have to do. From killing Zeno, fishing, eating noodles, drinking water, and steering the boat from these icebergs. But today, Sunny and I will make it to that island and save Mom no matter what. Oh no, Sunny. Mom's been kidnapped. And we don't have a lot of time. We have to grab as much food, drinks, and gas canisters as possible and throw them into the car, Melon. I will cook my first noodles. I will be on gas duty, Sonny. You get the agua and the nude. Oh, I got lots of water and lots of noodles. Boom! Bada bing! It's stocked up in the baggage compartment. And our idiot father. How could you let this happen to mama? Because he's useless, Sonny! Yeah, he actually had more ability once he was corrupted and evil. Now he just stands there looking at us. Like, do something! Cook some noodles! I'm actually speed running these gas cans. I've already got six of them. Good for you, Melon. I've only gotten two noodles. Why are you so trash at the video game? Because I keep yelling at Dad! You are an absolute sus man! I'll get all the gas cans, and then after I'm done with all the gas cans, Sonny will help you cook your noodles. Thanks, Melon. I appreciate you. Plus, we still have time, bro. It's only 9 o'clock. We have until 11 p.m., and then we gotta drive out. Oh, yeah. I get the noodles on the stove top. Get them extra crispy. Oh, I'm finally out of stamina. Mine's been charged up, bro. I'm good. I only have one more gas can to grab. Nice work, Melon. Then you could double up on the water and food. Hey, Sonny! What? I'm not in your way. Chill. You you were definitely in my way. You pushed me all the way back. I plead the fifth. I don't know what you're talking about. Grab some noodle. And we're kind of popping off right now. Bro, we are speed running this. Crispy and fresh noodles. We got nine of them in there. But we're running out of time, Sonny. It's okay. Once the clock strikes 11 p.m., we'll drive out on this road trip and we'll rescue mom no matter what. Even if I have no water. Even if I've got to drink the ocean. Nah, Melon, we'll just drink out of your skull because it's a watermelon. That's a good point. I'll juice you, Sonny. Ew, what? No. Uh, no, I'll juice your head. You're not going to juice me. I'm the sun. All right, fine. You can take my juice. Okay, how about this? This just sounds weird. No juice anybody, okay? You're the one that brought it here. No, I just wanted to... I, I don't know. Okay, I, I'll take it all back. Alright, dude, let's just drink out the ocean. Yeah, good idea. And then we'll get scurvy or whatever it is when you drink too much salt water. And Sonny, we had 16 noodles, 16 glasses of water, and 13 gas cans. Let's roll out. I think that's a record for us. Where's our dad? Who's driving this? Uh, it's a Tesla, Sonny. It's self-driving. Okay. World's first wooden Tesla. And the car's low Loki freaking out right now, bro. It's four-wheel drive. We're chilling, Sonny. It's just a little bit of off-roading. Yeah. Is this where mom went? She went off-roading through the spooky forest? Oh, I hope not. She'd probably be very scared. True. And we're about to crash into a tree. What is going on, bro? This car is crazy. Melon, looks like we're going to the beach. Blockswood Beach. What are we gonna do here, Sonny? I don't know. Maybe we'll wait for sunrise and enjoy it on the beachfront. Or maybe... We'll take a boat and cross the ocean to find mom. Wait, why did she cross the ocean? What is up with this kidnapper? I don't know, Sonny. And how we even know that he crossed the ocean, I also don't know. Maybe we ask this boatman and he can tell us what he's seen. Howdy, I heard Jerry wanted to buy a boat. Is that true? It depends, ship dealer. Did you see our mama cross this ocean? All right, I got the SS Mido Johnson available. It's quite small, but durable. Well, he didn't answer my question, Melon. We have no idea if mom went over here. Yeah, I guess we'll have to assume she did. All right, this boat will cost you 10 noodles and one glass of water. Bro, our food, our supplies. We have no choice. At least we have a lot of water, Sonny. All right, thanks for the payment. You guys can get in the ship now. Besides, Melon, we had 17 noodles, so we still have seven packs. Wait, Dad? Dad, don't leave! Dad, why are you leaving? Come back! An emergency business meeting? You're the worst father ever! Melon, it's been a few hours. <sighs> what 
do we have to do here? Tutorial. Control the boat and avoid icebergs. Get rid of the hooded men by shooting them and fix the fish and defend. Oh my goodness. Anything else you want us to do? Don't go outside. Eat and stay hydrated. Sonny, I will steer the ship. I will grab noodles and water for myself along with a gun, a hammer, and a rod. Dude, why can't I get in? Please. Thank you. Melon, man the ship. Hold on, I first need to grab everything here. F, F, F. And I shall man the ship, Sonny. The throttle speed's at 200%. Can't fish while the boat is moving. What's the point in fishing then? Hold on, Sonny, start fishing. I can't. Oh, you, you, oh, you stopped the boat. Look out, there's a Xeno man. Sonny, he's gonna kill you. You gotta shoot him dead. I got him, I got him. He's done for. I can't fish the boat. Boat's moving. I'm not even moving the boat. You got nothing. Oh, it's random RNG. I'm trying to fish. I keep getting nothing out here. Melon, you could join me. You could come fishing. Mm, nah, I'm setting the throttle to 100%. I found raw noodles. I found spaghetti and meatballs. I'm in the ocean. You just moved the boat. You idiot. Are you dead? Yes. Why'd you go in the ocean? What is wrong with you? All you literally needed to say was, hey, Sonny, I'm going to start driving the boat. I'm standing on the edge of it fishing. I said, hey, Sonny, I'm gonna drive now. I didn't say it like that, but I said, I'm starting the boat now. Okay, dude. Well, then let, give me a chance to acknowledge it. What the heck, man? What the heck? I just put the oxygen in. Noodle, noodle. Oh, I almost died. You're actually the worst captain ever, and I think we're gonna die now. I lost all my gear. I figured you were on the boat fishing, not in the water fishing. You could have asked. I'm not in the water fishing. I'm on the edge of the boat. As soon as you started the engine, it flung me in the water. All right, go fishing again. Actually, it's freezing. No, I'm not. I'm not doing it. I'm going to bed. That's it, Sonny. I'll do everything around here. I'm literally going to go to sleep. I'm going at 100%. Just got to dodge these icebergers. Icebergs dodged. I'm doing a great job right now, and I don't think the Xenomen really do much. <laughs> Sonny, are you really sleeping right now? Sorry, did somebody say something? Yeah, bro. I'm literally manning this ship so we can save our mom. I'm doing everything right now. <sighs> yeah, keep up the good work. Sounds boring. <sighs> Oh my goodness, I can't believe this guy. I swear if the generator goes out and he doesn't do anything about it, I'm gonna be very upset. Sonny, there's, there's a lot of Xeno men. I think... Sonny, fill the generator! Well, I am feeling energized after that nap. Ooh, yeah, that was nice. Oh, Xeno man coming in hot. I gotta fill the Jenny. Sonny, if, if, you don't, if you don't fill the Jenny, we're gonna die. Relax, the Jenny's filled up. I gotta shoot some Xeno mans. Die! Sonny, I need to go to sleep. I'm gonna die. All right, rest up. Rest easy, rest easy. I need, I need water. I need something. I don't know what's going on. I need to sleep. You need to man the ship, Sonny. There's no choice. I'm driving. Throttle increased to 25%. We got icebergs coming up. Increasing speed. Because if you're going to hit an iceberg, you might as well ram it at maximum speed. And I think I might go outside and deal with these Xeno men pretty soon. I got it. I got it. Don't worry, Sonny. Don't worry. Wait, what the heck? Sonny! What is wrong with you? No, I can't. It won't let me steer. Bro, let me, let me steer. Go outside and fix the ship. I will try my best. First, I will eat noodles. It's a little cold out here, Melon. Oh my goodness. I might hit an iceberg here. Oh, that was a close one. What am I fixing? I don't see anything. Right there to the left, to your right. Got it. Fixed up. No way you actually hit it? Yeah, buddy. I gotta stay inside though, because it was... Oh wait, it's warm enough. I could go shoot the Xeno men. Time to clear them out, Melon. There's a lot of them in this ocean. Uh, Sonny! I'm, I'm, I'm gonna hit an iceberg here. Sorry. It's okay. It's okay. I'll look for the repair. Oh! I'm dead. Sonny, how did you die? A Xeno man appeared out of nowhere. I wasn't prepared. I'm hungry now. I need water. I need energy. Oh my goodness, Sonny. It's all right. We're really getting close. We're one fifth of the way. Just keep up the good work. Sonny, how do you keep dying? At least you got to revive yourself. Yeah, I don't know. Xeno man showed up out of nowhere. What do you want me to say? Is the ship broken right now or it's all good? It's, I think it's mostly fine. I just needed to go to sleep because I was dying. I'm refilling the Jenny and my energy is starting to get pretty low as well. I'm not gonna cap. Okay. Charging up, Sonny. Your health is super low, by the way. Yeah, I know, dude. I took a bunch of damage earlier. I'm gonna start zooming again. Throttle 100%. I'm checking the temp. 10 degrees. We're good. We don't need all these lights. We can save some generator. Oh my gosh. I actually just split those rocks. Sonny, there's so many Xeno men. I got it. I got it. Get off. Get off of our ship. Bro, this is so inaccurate. Just shoot him already. Kill them, Sonny. 
I'm trying. More of them are getting on the ship as I fire. Oh, this is weird. This is weird, Melon. Got him. There's more. Sonny, do you need my help? I think I got this. This is actually insane how many there are. I cleared out like five of them. Bro, I almost flew off the ship again. Be careful when you're out there, Sonny. Is there anything for me to wrangle up in this ocean? Can't fish while moving. Here, you can fish a little bit. Oh, click to fix. Oh, bro, all these rusty bits, I gotta fix them. Take these Xenomans out. Don't let them on the boat. I'm going 100%, Sonny. There's a Xenoman chasing you. I got it. I got it. Bro, this is crazy. All right, I gotta come back in, Melon. I gotta do some eating and some sleeping. Oh, I just barely dodged that iceberg. Can I open the door? This game is so weird. Oh, the Jenny is still 50. We're good. I'm gonna get a snack and sleep. Let me know if there's a bunch of Xenomans. I'll handle it. I'll let you know, Sonny. Hold on. I'm gonna get out of the captain seat for a second. I am very thirsty and hungry. Did you turn the boat off? Let me grab some nude. Nope, because I'm a man. That's crazy. You put it on autopilot? Yep. Straight ahead. Sonny, I'm gonna have to sleep soon, so you're gonna have to man the wheel. Oh no, I just slow down. Oh, this is not good. I have no choice. Melon! I didn't have a choice. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Hold on. Let me drink my water. Eat my noodles. Oh, it's too cold. Can't fix it. It's fine, Sonny. I don't think we're damaged too much. All right, I'll go back to sleep then. Sonny, I need to, I need to, I can't. I gotta sleep. You gotta man the wheel. All right, the wheel has been manned. Is the speed on? We're not moving. There we go. 50% speed. I think I can handle that. Bro, you gotta go at 100%. Come on. 75. Dude, we're not even halfway there. 100. I was inching my way up. Just sleep, okay, Melon? Sleep and rest peace. Peacefully. I'll handle this. I'll sleep with one eye open. And if I see an iceberg that I cannot avoid, I shall slow down. There's a lot of Xenos coming in, Melon. Don't you like me to clear them out, Sonny? Let me check the temperature. It's too cold. You can't go outside right now. We're gonna have to let them build up. Feels good, bro. We actually know how to play. Yeah, we're actually killing it now. But I need to get a gas canister for the Jenny. Okay. Yeah, you need to do that quick because I can't steer when there's no gas. I adjusted the speed at the correct moment to to avoid that iceberg, it was perfect. Now I go back to 100. Can I go outside yet? I don't want to kill these Xeno men. Check the temperature. Is it above negative one? Melon, look at this iceberg. Oh, unlucky. Sonny! Dude, I tried to dodge it. I really did. I even stopped the engine. Dude, it's still negative six out there. I can't kill the Xeno men. Why can't I drive right now? There we go. Oh, no. Dodge it, bro. You're chilling. That was close. What's the temperature look like? It's looking like a solid negative 3.8. It keeps making me not be able to steer. Just says you're currently sitting out of nowhere. No, where the where does it keep going? Why can't I steer? Melon, you gotta do it. All right, I got this, Sonny. Don't even worry. <sighs> I'm gonna sleep. You go to sleep, my friend. Hey, it's warming up. I could go outside now. I will repair the ship and destroy the Xenomans. Beautiful, Sonny. Yeah, it just did that to me too. It just took away my steering wheel. It keeps doing it over and over again. Oh, that's a lot of Xenos. Bring them down. Bring down the evil. Oh, oh, that was close. Melon, there's there's a lot more Xenos trying to board the ship. I'll take them out as best I can. Kill all of the Xeno men. I'm trying, bro. Look at my spot. I'm on top of the ship. This is goaded. Oh, absolutely obliterated them. Now let me do some repairs. Bing, bing, bing. I repair the ship, Sonny. I'll swab the deck and repair the ship. Fixed. And a Xeno thinks he can board our ship. Not again. I obliterated him. And let's see. We're making some pretty good time. We're over halfway there. Not bad. And it's 7 a.m. Didn't even have to move. Just went straight through those two icebergs. If you need to stop. Oh, no, I need to eat. No, 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 no. Food, 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 food. Noodles! Holy schmoly! Did you almost die, Sonny? Maybe. Come on, bro. We can't be having that. It was very close. Oh, no. I gotta close this door. Then I can sleep peacefully. Do, 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 do. I gotta get my energy up, and then I'll go shoot up those Xenos. How close are we? We are almost three quarters of the way there. Not bad. Keep an eye on our food. Says seven noodles left. Seven waters. Bro, does this ever run out? Uh, I think it has been dropping. Yeah, we're at six noodles. I could do some fishing if we need. Uh, I don't think we need to. I think we're pretty close. But first, I'm gonna- Oh no! Not this again! Oh, I'm back on. I'm back on. What killed me? Bro, I was in the boat again and I started dying! No! Sonny! And I just hit an iceberg. What the heck? It says I can still revive. I'm alive. Last go. Sonny, don't fall off the boat again. No, that was cringe. I was trying to jump on top. It let me jump on top and then oh my bad i adjusted your throttle and then all of a sudden i was in the ocean but then i jumped back into the boat but i was still dying it's like once you touch that ocean water you're done for yeah i think it's 
an instant death. I wanted to eliminate the Xeno safely. I won't try it again, though. I'll just shoot him. We might need to do some fishing soon. I'm just saying. Nah, bro. We're so close to the island. Are we really? Kind of. Let's see. Oh, we're getting there. The only thing is it's about to get cold again. Let me take these Xenos out quick. I just died. What killed me? Sonny, I don't even know what killed me, but I died. Maybe the cold? You better man the ship. Wait, all of a sudden, my energy's gone. What the heck? The cold drains your energy really fast. Dude, let me sit in the seat. I can't sit in the seat, Sonny. Hold on. I got gas for the Jenny before we die. Let refill. Thank goodness. Sonny, can you sit in the driver's seat? It won't let me. Sorry, I, I really, really needed to lie down. I have no energy. Oh, no. I'm going to be seasick by the end of this one. Sonny, there's so many icebergs, too, and it won't let me sit. Why? What is this? Uh, we'll just put the throttle to zero and check the temp. It's way too cold to fish. Never mind. All right, I'll give it a, I'll give it a go. Captain C. Yeah, it's doing the same thing for me. What is going on here? I think it's because I, I now am below the boat. What just happened? Why am I below? I made the boat and I'm dying. <laughs> the generator's out of fuel instantly. It just had full... What is going on? Bro, this game is so glitched. It's not even fair. Okay, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Tank the icebergs! Just go! Well, yeah, we have no choice. We can't really steer anymore. Melon, I have an idea. We take some hits. We wait for it to warm up. I'll go to zero. And then we'll fix the ship. We'll just wait for it to warm up now. Let's just sleep it off. Uh, Sonny, I don't think it's warming up. It'll warm up. It's just random. Just give it time, Melon. Give it time. Yep, I'm giving it time. Melon, if you hit too many icebergs and we can't fix it, we're gonna die. We're not gonna die, Sonny. We can take a lot of iceberg hits. Melon, I think you should. I think I think you should just stop the boat and sleep. Oh uh, yeah, maybe we should probably sleep now because we need to fish and stuff if we want to do this strategy. Yeah, we're getting close, but we need to let it warm up. It's starting to warm up. Look at the temperature. It's rising. It's getting warmer. Negative six. Negative five and a half. We're getting there. Melon, just conserve your energy for the big day. I am so ready to kill these Xenos. It's 10 a.m. We're gonna start the morning off fresh by popping off a few Xenomans and then fishing. Also, is there a time limit we have? to get there? Let's not worry about that right now. We got bigger fish to fry. Noodles and water in your inventory. I'm going out there. Oh, it's still too cold. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh my god, I lost all my energy. Sunny. It's negative 0.2. 0.1. Okay, I'm going outside. That is toxic. No, what the heck? It got cold again. Generator melon, please. Okay, this is it, dude. It's, it's definitely above one degrees right now. Yeah, it's three degrees. Xeno. I need to kill all these Xenos. Okay. Roll up on them. Nice work. And now we fix. We fix. I'll do the fixes. You start fishing. How am I supposed to fix under the boat? Is that a joke? Do I just spam it? The fishing rod? Yeah, you just keep clicking the water. I found a gas can. Nice. Oh, Xeno attack. I found a raw noodle. I found a donut. I found meatballs. Very good, Mela. Just keep your eyes out for Xenos. Ow! Sonny, you're supposed to be defending me. The Xeno almost killed me. I'm trying to fix this boat that you ruined, but I don't know how to get down there to fix it. Yeah, I don't know if we can fix that stuff, I'll be honest. But I got so much food now. Wait, maybe I can take a quick dip, Sonny. Melon, if you go in, you die. I'm just telling you. And you're gonna lose all the food that you just got. I should do this. Uh, are you sure? Yeah, because I... Well, there's gotta be a way to fix this. Come on now. Like, what about from the inside? Can you let me in? Oh, these stupid Xenos, bro. Okay, Melon, you get back. Melon, you idiot. Why are you doing this? <sighs> I hate this game! You literally had all the food. All you had to do was go in and wait for me to do it. No, oh, Xeno killed me, you idiot. I know. Why are you out here? What's the point? Go and man the ship. Nope, now I'm fishing. I'll refill the generator. I'll refill the generator. I don't trust you. Oh, no, I just turned the throttle on. Turn that off, please. Cook my noodles. Look, Sonny, it's so easy to get stuff. Turn the throttle off, and we'll just get a bunch of food, and we'll be chilling. We have to do this quick before it gets cold again. I got stuff for myself. Remember, I can't give you stuff, so you gotta get yourself some stuff. All right, I'm fishing. Can this go a little faster, though, please? Let me catch the fish. I'm about to run out of energy. All right, I got too much stuff on me. I'm going. All right, if you have a bunch of stuff, that's fine, because there's still more food in our chests. And I still can't sit, unfortunately, but it is what it is. Melon, Melon. What, we're chilling. I gotta sleep. <gasps> Zeno, what the heck? They can't keep jump scaring me like this. Oh, that is cold outside. It's cold outside. How close are we? We're getting there, Sonny. It's 0 p.m. Oh, no. I don't like 0 p.m. But we're 400 out of 500 miles. Excellent. We're almost there. I got squid, bro. I can eat squid. Do you have to cook it first? No, I just eat it 
raw? Actually, no, I do have to cook it. I'm gonna cook this squid up. Get cooking. I've been snoozing good. Oh, no. We need to do some repairs badly. How do you repair under the ship? That's so toxic. I'm pretty sure you're supposed to be able to climb back in the ship. Maybe when it's too cold out. Maybe when it's too cold out, it doesn't let you. I'm throttling until I see an iceberg. I'm just gonna sleep again. I might as well. It's the only useful thing I can do. It's too bad we can't buy warmer clothes. We might hit- Yeah, we're gonna hit this iceberg. Should I stop? Probably. We have a lot of repairs. We're only 50 miles away, brah. But we need to fix the ship. Is the temperature going warmer? No, it's, it's still getting colder. It's negative 10. Oh my goodness gracious. Can I fish from here? Let me try. Let me cheese it. Oh, too cold. Well, I'll close that up. Melon, I think that's a very bad idea. Bro, what are we gonna do? We just have to wait till it warms up. It's starting to get warmer. And then we gotta go crazy on the repairs. I will sacrifice myself melon and you need to do a lot of fishing oh bro we need more fuel we're running low on that actually i know we're running low on everything it's not looking good we're so close to the island we have 50 miles left we need this thing to warm up already just just sleep make sure your energy is charged i'm gonna have to eat our final noodles i think i have uh, some cooked noodles i have two cooked noodles on me yeah you can't die you gotta keep those turn the lights off we gotta conserve energy and melon for our last part of the voyage we could put on the auto defense iceberg oh no i need to eat i need to eat i need these noodles Dude, I don't even know what it does. Melon, we have two glasses of water left. I'm not gonna drink it because I'm gonna die here. I'm going out. First things first, eliminate the Xenos and repair the ship. No. No, this Xeno! I got stuck again! Why? It's really not hard. No, I keep getting stuck on stuff and then he just traps me. It's so annoying. We needed you to have lots of food supplies. I'm just saying. It's fine, dude. I'll just go fishing again and get tons of stuff. I'm about to die. I'm gonna go underneath and fix this stuff. Geronimo! Wait, I'm not- I'm, I'm actually so confused. I fixed them! I fixed them! <laughs> you died, sonny. I think there was actually a way to fix it without dying. That was very confusing, though. I just got three raw noodles. Not bad, not bad. And a squid and more raw noodle. Yeah, I need some of this quick. Keep your eyes peeled for the Xenomans. Also, we could just pay this guy, actually. I'll buy a gas can to be safe. Yeah, that's it. I'm going full steam ahead, sonny. Turn on the auto defense. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was weird. Mela, there's a Xeno! Mela, there's a Xeno! Don't let him kill me! Oh, no. Come on, man. I closed the door. This game is so glitchy. It's actually toxic. I lost all my stuff. Oh, no. Sonny, I, I, can you can you please grab it? I can't grab it. Yeah, it's glitching for you? Yes. Or do you have a full inventory? Must be nice. What am I dying from? Oh, my goodness. Sonny, we're there. I'm, I'm full steaming ahead. I don't care. I don't care. I'm gonna just shop. I'm over it as well. I'm buying noodles and stuff. What the heck? How close are we? 25 miles to go! Come on. On. We can do this. I see what the auto defense does. It shoots the icebergs in front of us, but it takes off a huge amount of gas. Yes, I know that, Melon. Why don't you use your gas canister that's inside of your inventory? I don't have one, you idiot. It's in your inventory. I know you have one. Press the tilde key. Press the tilde key. Oh, I do have one. How did you know that? Because I saw you grab one and it went down the number. Well, yes, I do have one. Oh, I'm on top of the boat. Zeno tried to get me, but he can't. Sonny, we're there. In one more mile. We did did it! Arriving to the new island! Bro, that was so stressful. It's truly, truly beautiful, Mel. The airport. Why are we at the airport? I don't understand. We had to work so hard. Maybe this is where mom got kidnapped. He flew her in. But right now, Sonny, we need to prepare by going to the weapon store. And prepare carefully, we shall. Bro, this is one bumpy car ride. What is the deal? I don't know, Sonny. But what I do know is that we've arrived at Sam's weapon store. And it's time to arm ourselves with the most powerful weapons in all of Roblox. Hey, you. Want to buy some weapons? Well, actually, yes, yeah, Sam, we do. Well, it's still 6 a.m., so most of the items are still not ready. But hey, don't worry. I got these old bats, and it's for free. I haven't used it much, really. Are you kidding me? He's giving us baseball bats? This is not a good weapon, Melon. I was hoping to get a bazooka or, like, a minigun. Yeah, I don't understand. We had pistols before. I Ow! Was it actually hurting you? No. Actually, I think it was. Maybe we don't smack each other. I don't understand. We have pistols. Why don't we just bring them? Oh, yeah, true. We were shooting the Xeno Man on our boat the whole time. But now we've downgraded to a wooden bat. Objective. Go inside the cave. Melon, this cave says danger. Do not enter. Authorized personnel only. Are you sure we should go in there? Absolutely, we should, Sonny. It's for our mama! How do we know she's even down there? Trust me, I know. Mom! No, that's Xeno Man. No, I saw mom. She was in the chair. Oh no, it's not Xenoman. It's Xenobus! Otherwise, it will be
be the most dire consequences for you and your mom if you don't leave at once. Oh no, Sonny. If you want to save mom, fight me right now. I'll kill you, Xenobus! I'm out of Xenobus on ya! Yeah! Hit him with a bat! Hit him with a bat! Bro, hold and release. Sonny, be careful. Be careful. You gotta hit him when he's red. Hit him when he's red. I'm trying. He's taking no damage. Yeah, he is. Yeah, he is. Okay, the number just doesn't go down. Ow. He's in my face. Go away. Sonny, you're taking heavy damage. Be careful. Nah, I'm slapping him up good. Don't worry, Mom. We'll get you out of here. Wait, no. I'm stuck in the chair. Melon! Melon, help! Look at me! Sonny, get out of there! That was cursed, bro. Oh, I'm almost dead. I need to back up. Good luck, Melon. Die, Xenobus! I'm gonna have to be real careful here for a bit. Yeah, I'm really low, too. Just one hit. One hit at a time. Going in. Slap. Back up. How did he hit me there? I don't understand. Because he's trying to steal your mother's soul. Okay. We did big damage, Sonny. He's probably at like 40 HP. Yeah, except the problem is I don't know how he damages us. It's like he spins. Sometimes he looks at you and it hurts. You just got to have a big distance between you. All right. Keep our cool. Keep our cool. And slap. Slap! He hit me. He hit me big time there, Sonny. Yeah, I'm on one hit and then I'm dead. Same. Stay away. Stay away from me. Got him. Got him good. Come on. This is close. This is really close. Oh, no! Oh, I can revive. Sonny, you idiot! I'm reviving, I hope. Don't die, Melon. Whatever you do, don't die. I got this, Sonny. Don't worry. I'll never die. Oh, this is fine, bro. I'm alive again. Who cares? Oh, yeah. Let's just hit him now. Die! Beat him up. Beat him up. Oh, you want to talk to me, Xenobus? Talk to my bat! About a Xeno bus you. Xeno bus him back to school. Yeah! That's right. That's right. Then we dance on him. Finally, we have defeated that evil monster. Once and for all, there should be no more weird strict parents. Mama, I hope you're okay. We're gonna save you right now. Thank you, kiddos. You've saved me. Oh, are we gonna get a cutscene? Let's go. Thank you for saving mom. I would have died if you guys were not there. You're welcome. Now let's go home and meet your father. Oh no. No, no. Oh no. No! Don't tell me our dad's gonna be weirdly strict all over again. Bruh. Oh my goodness. Did you see the graphics on that? It was crazy. Well, now we have to save our dad. Again. We're really gonna use an airplane to track down the weird strict dad now? Dude, this game gets crazier and crazier. But I can't wait for chapter four. It's gonna to be awesome. And if you goats want to see it first, press the like button and subscribe to our channel. Today, Sunny and I are playing hide and seek as fruits. We can become any fruit we've collected over the Secret Staycation series. More than just fruits, we can even become food. And then we're gonna hide anywhere on this giant map. And let me tell you, goats, I find the ultimate hiding spot. Stick around to see what I mean. Melon, it's time for hide and seek on the Secret Staycation. And don't forget to disable the name tags. That'd be cheating. All right. Sonny, all right. I'll disable the name tags. I already had them disabled though, Sonny. I'm not a cheat unlike you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why don't you cool that melon down and go hide? I'll push you out of here with my coconut. I'm way bigger than you, little bro. No! No! Ah, uh, you got... No! Dang it! Bro, we both fell. I mean, I didn't fall. What are you talking about? Uh, I was just transforming into pizza. Well, for round number one, Sonny, I'm gonna be hiding as the watermelon. So good luck finding me. Bro, that might be the dumbest idea ever. Good luck with that. I'm gonna start counting now. You've got 99 seconds. Bro, can I get out of this ice rink, please? No, Sonny, I, I gotta reset my character. It's actually ridiculous. It's fine, bro. You can play as any food you want. You don't have to be the Wander. It's too late. I've already chosen the Wander. All right, well, good luck with that. I'm gonna keep counting now. Okay, gods, I've gotta find a good spot. First things first, I need to open this door. Let me through. Now now that I've opened the door, let's close it. Hopefully you have to be a big fruit to do that. Closing the door. And I know I'm hiding is the watermelon. This is the hardest fruit to hide as because it's the biggest one. But at the same time, I feel like I have to represent watermelons everywhere and win this round of hide and seek. So what I'm gonna do is gonna be extra 
ordinary goats. I'm gonna hide inside of the bathtub. I've just gotta find a way to get up there. First things first, I've gotta climb on this stool. Come on, get me up. Now, hopefully, I can make this jump over here. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do it, but I'll try. Yeah, no. Goats, I don't know if this is doable. Get me up. Another try. We'll try from a little further back. Okay, yeah, I don't know if this is gonna happen. Third time's the charm. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's not gonna happen. Dude, where am I gonna hide as the wander? I think I'm gonna have to hide in this laundry machine and just hope Sonny doesn't come and find me here. Yeah, come on, let me in. I've done it. I'm in the laundry machine. Now, I really gotta hope Sonny doesn't check this thing. Bro, are you finished hiding yet? It's been over 95 seconds. I'm hidden, Sonny. Good, because you had three seconds left. And now I shall find the watermelon and destroy him. I wish I could pick up this rolling pin and just use it on you. Bro, you already know you're not gonna find me. Quit the cap. All right, first question for you. Are you hiding behind the watermelon? Nope. Okay, I figured I'd ask because that would be a perfect spot if you blended in right behind it. Then I would never even look. I don't even think you can get up there as a watermelon, Sonny. Oh, you think you're too thick? Like, yeah, you actually definitely cannot get up there. Whatever, I'm gonna just check this pot. Nope, that is only the potato. You are not in there. Like I said, Sonny, my hiding spot is top secret and you're never gonna find me. Well, if the watermelon is too big to get up there, that means it's too large and juicy to get on the fridge. So you can't be hiding there either. <laughs> are you sure about it? Yeah, I'm positive, bro. That was way too tight of a gap. You're probably hiding in the back bathroom. Open up. Wait, how is this door closed? Guys, it's not good. I really hope he doesn't check everything thoroughly in here. How do you open this door? I'm so confused. Oh, wait, you can't open the door, Sonny? <laughs> what? How does this door get closed? I've never seen that. Oh, maybe you have to be a big fruit like a watermelon to open it. Are you kidding me? That's a thing? I've never seen that. Wait, you're probably hiding behind the door, squeezing it shut. No, I'm not, Sonny. Okay, I'm gonna choose a bigger fruit. That is crazy. How can I not open that door? I'll be a pumpkin, your worst enemy. Yeah, but then you won't be able to move around and everything. That's fine. I just have to open this dang door up. Every time we've played this game, the door's open. Bro, I can actually push it. It's so slow. Congratulations, Sonny. You're doing it. Yeah, I'm doing it, and I'm gonna open it all the way up till the door stop, and please tell me that locks it in place. It did, Melon. Now that I've opened the door fully, I can transform into any food I want. I'm gonna become a chili pepper! Goats, I don't have a lot of time. I've gotta close the door! Come on, come on! Behind it, and start pushing! And then I launch myself down! Wait, why is the door closing? No, don't close! No, come on, stop it! Close the door! Are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> nice one, Sonny. I got him. Please, little chili pepper, slip through the crack. Melon, I see you. You did this. You did this. <laughs> and I'm gonna keep doing it, Sonny. You're never gonna find me. I wouldn't be so sure. This chili pepper is very small, Melon. Come on. Oh, wait. I think I can do this. Uh oh, goats. I've got to find a spot to hide. Sonny, you've only got 30 seconds left. That's cap. I have two minutes. No, nope, you got 30 seconds. No, that's cap. How do I squeeze through? My chili pepper head is too big. I thought I could do it. Dang it. Sonny, I'm actually gonna beat you as the wander. No, you're not. Because I'm gonna become even smaller. Oh, yes. One little caviar should be able to fit back here. Please, please just squeeze in. Squeeze in and go. I think it's working. It worked. Up through the door. No freaking way. Melon, I know you're in this bathtub. Oh, yeah. Uh, now you actually have 30 seconds left, Sonny. No cap. Well, this is going to be quick to check. Wait a second. There's no way you could be in the bathtub. You probably can't even climb up here. Hold on. I'll just zoom out. Wait a second. I don't even have to jump in. I could just zoom out and look. And I don't see a watermelon in there, which means one thing. Uh, what's the one thing, Sonny? You're in the laundry machine. 10 seconds left. Nine, eight, seven, six, five. Five, four, three, two, one, I win! Are you kidding me? I was right here. You were too slow, my sonny boy. Dang you! 
How do I lose when you're a big fat watermelon? You shouldn't underestimate large fruits. Well, you shouldn't underestimate me. Because in the next round of hide and seek, I'm going to disappear. We'll see about that. I'm not going to be the wanderer this time. I'm going strawberry mode. You do that. I'm going to go nuts. <laughs> I see what you did there, Sonny. Your two minutes starts now. And goats, I'm going to do something Melon will never, ever, ever in a million years suspect. As the peanut, I think I can squeeze through the mouse hole. Oh, yeah. We're in the tunnels. I'm going to go outside if I can remember how to get there. I think I go this way. Oh, please tell me I can find it. I guess I could just lie down in here somewhere, too, and the rat will probably keep killing him. I'm not going to cap, though. I don't know where I'm going. This is totally random, but I think I might have found it. No way. Never mind. It's just another dead end. And the rat is here. No, no, no. You can't eat peanuts. I'm not healthy. Oh, dodged. Now what, rat? Go away. Go away, rat. Is this it? Is this the escape to the outside? Why won't it leave me alone? No. Are you serious? Maybe this is a hiding spot all to itself. Melon, I'm ready. You're finally ready, Sonny. I sure am. Then I'm ready to find you. Good luck with that. Now, Sonny, for my first question, are you hiding past the door or uh, not past the door? What does that mean? What do you mean past the door? The giant door to the bathroom. Oh, no, I'm not in the bathroom. Why didn't you just say am I in the bathroom? Oh, my goodness, because you could be in the hallway and you could be annoying about it. No, no, no I'm not. I'm not beyond that door. Well, Sonny, I shall ask you my second question. Are you in some kind of secret hiding spot? Well, isn't that the whole point of hide and seek? Yeah, but you know what I mean, Sonny, a secret spot. It's completely different from a normal spot. Yes, I'm in a secret spot. Okay. Now, I'm just going to hone in. What kind of secret spot is he hiding in? There's a few places he could be. He's not in the train. I can confirm that. Oh, that would have been brilliant. Hmm, Sonny. My third and final question will be... Yes, I'm handsome and a crunchy peanut. No, that's not what I was going to ask. I was going to say, is there some kind of of animal that would be consuming you right now? Uh, why would you ask something so oddly specific? Okay, let me just rephrase it. Do I have to get through the rat to get to your spot? Well, you're out of question, so you can't rephrase it, but I'll answer the first one. I am hiding somewhere in the rat area. Oh my goodness. As a strawberry, I'm too big to even get in there. He's too bulky. I need to go blueberry mode. Boom! Sonny, you scumbag. Oh, I should have asked more questions, like, if you're hiding outside. Sonny, are you hiding outside? I'm not hiding outside. Were you honest with me right there? Yes, I'm being serious, bro. I'm just a handsome peanut. <gasps> I've got to find this handsome peanut. I can't believe that actually worked, guys. And now I will disappear into the mouse hole. I swear this mouse is chasing somebody. Yeah, you. <laughs> oh, I'm actually the goat for this play. You're right, Sonny. He is chasing me. He just came out of nowhere. Don't get eaten. Oh, no. But maybe he'll take me to you on the way back. Oh, he's chasing me hard. He's chasing me hard. Come on. Come on. No, he got me. Easy game. Maybe I'll see you on the way back. Back, huh? Maybe you will, maybe you won't. All I've got to do is wait for the rat to find you, bro. He's going to sniff you out. Yeah, Melon, I'm pretty sure the rat's never going to find me. What is that supposed to mean? Means my spot is goaded. Does that mean you're nowhere in the rat maze and you just capped to me? I'm not capping. Bro, if you're not in the rat maze, you're capping on me. I'm not capping on you, bro. I was in the rat maze. What do you mean you were in the rat maze? I was in there. Are you still in here? Oh my goodness. You left. You left the rat maze, didn't you? Uh... Why would you come this way? You were supposed to think I went outside. I found you, Sonny! Dang it. I can't believe you came back to this tunnel. I thought for sure you'd assume I got to the outside spot. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I win. You know what's hilarious, though? You walked right past me. I honestly did not notice you at all. No, I wasn't there the first time, but I was right at the entrance to the maze right in this corner. Bro, you're so 
such a cheeser. Well, Melon, you've got one more chance to win this thing. I'm gonna start counting now. One, two, three, four. Okay, goats, I've gotta get up here because I saw something. A fruit I don't think I've yet claimed. The cherry tomato. And now I need to see if I can fit inside this train. I think I'm small enough. This will be an excellent hiding spot and I will secure my win against Sunny. I've just gotta spam to get in there. Oh, this might take a while. I've got an even better spot. If I just stay glitched in the wheels, I'll be moving underneath the train pretty much. This is perfect. All right, Sonny, I'm ready. Bro, that was so fast. How are you good to go like that? Let's just say I found a pretty good hiding spot. Oh, no. Uh, Sonny, maybe I'm not ready. Maybe, maybe. I no, I'm ready. I'm ready. Wait, I can see you, bro. You transformed into the strawberry again? No, what are you talking about? Oh, that's actually just the strawberry. Hey, goats, this isn't the best case scenario, but it is what it is. Melon, for my first question, are you hiding using the watermelon? No. I just thought I'd ask. I feel like you'd be obsessed with it. All right, second question. Are you inside or outside? I would say I'm outside. How are you outside? Uh, I just am. Coats, my hiding spots actually go to that. Take it back. I'm so confused. Oh, sorry. Uh, sorry. I meant, I meant inside. I don't know what I was saying there. I'm inside. What? No, I got another question for that. What? Fine, bro. You want to ask me what I'm close to? Fine. What object are you closest to? I'm close to the TV. Sorry. No, the bookshelf. Which one is it, Melon? The bookshelf. You're on the train. Uh, I'm actually not on the train, Sonny. I'll give you that. Because guys, technically, look at this. I'm actually on the train track. I'm so confused. He walked right past me. He didn't even notice. This is so weird. You said you were closest to the TV. Then you changed your mind and said the bookshelf right as the train was driving on. But I don't see anything. Actually, Sonny, I'm closest to the sink now. You're definitely on the train, but how are you doing it? Oh, this is amazing, goats. I love my hiding spot so much. Okay, I need to change into something even smaller. Let's see. Small, small, small. Yeah, we'll be, we'll be a cheese. Oh, this is squishy. Melon, I see the train. Let me guess. You're closest to the couch. Hold on. I'm actually closest to the window right now. Yeah, hilarious. He's on this train, but he lied about it, which is really sus. Bruh, I'm not on the train, brah. Chill, brah. Okay, you're on it. There's no way you're not. I'm not on the train. I promise you I'm not on the train. Bro, I just fell out of the world through the train. I'm so confused. How did I just go in the void? Are you stuck on a train wheel? What was that? What are you talking about? It's like something squished on this wheel. Oh no, it's just a shadow. Yeah, don't worry about it, Sonny. Where are you, bro? I'm trying to get squished into the train, but I'm so confused. Yep, don't worry about a thing. Goats, my hiding spot is elite. I see something on this wheel. Uh... But I don't know what it is or how you did it. <laughs> what are you not seeing, Sonny? Bro, I just saw like a tiny little leg sticking out. I see it under the track. <laughs> You've got 30 seconds left, Sonny. Bro, there's nothing I can do. You literally cheated. What do you mean I cheated? I can't tag you. I can't even see you. All I see is your legs. <laughs> oh, you're gonna feel like such an idiot, Sonny. Bro, I don't even know what food you are. Oh no, guys, I'm rolling out of control. What is happening? Maybe you'll get launched. I see you. Your character's freaking out. No, Sonny. Sonny, 10 seconds left. You're a blueberry. I see you. Uh, five, four. Oh, you messed up by going on the ice skating rig. That's GG, Sonny. Whatever, bro. I'll give you credit where it's due. Congratulations, you won this hide and seek. Now tell me how you did that. I'm just on the wheel, bro. I just ragdolled right next to the wheel. That's it? Yeah, was I inside the wheel? I can still only see your legs. <laughs> on my screen, I'm not in the wheel. Bro, on my screen, you were fully invisible for most of it. I can only see the legs underneath the track. Dude, I think I had the most goaded hiding spot of all time. GG, whatever. You win. And goats, comment down below if you want to see us play more Secret Staycation. So I got Melon and I new jobs working the overnight security shift at this roller coaster park because I always thought Melon wanted to enjoy these rides with no lineups. But it turns out he's actually afraid of heights. So now we just need to survive at this scary cursed theme park. Help us reach 3,000 likes on this video to avoid getting eaten by this monster. Let's go. Sonny, I told you 
you, the last thing I wanted to do was go to a theme park. Oh, I thought you said you wanted to go ride roller coasters. No, I said that's not what I want to do. Dang it. Okay, well, I guess you're just really boring. You don't like rides. What's the problem? No, because they're creepy. They're terrifying, Sonny. Look at this place and everything goes wrong. Nothing goes wrong, bro. We're the only ones here. We get to do the theme park by ourselves late at night. That's why we broke into this place. What do you mean we're by ourselves? Did you not just hear those screams? There were screams? Probably screams of joy because <laughs> theme parks are super fun. Yeah, I don't want to hear that right now when we're supposed to be alone. The park's closed down. Whatever, bro. We're just working the late night shift. I turned the lights on because the boss asked us to. All right, Melon, we need to collect prizes and set them up so that everyone tomorrow can scream for joy again. Uh, okay. Uh, I don't like this, Sonny, though. I think something's gonna go wrong. Nothing can go wrong, bro. Just stock up the prize shelves. I don't know, dude. These teddy bears are pretty creepy. Nah, dude. They look cute and cuddly. I wish I had some teddy bears like this. I personally am good without having them. <sighs> it's again, Melon, because you're not fun. We've been over this. You don't like roller coasters. You don't like adventures. Now you don't like teddy bears? What's next? You're gonna tell me you don't like watermelons? Hey, I like adventure. Ah! This is what I'm talking about! What, dude? It's just a guest. He wants to come ride in the park. No, that guy has tried to eat us so many times, Sonny, and he even has eaten us sometimes. I don't know what you're talking about, bro. Just stay focused on the job at hand. We need to stock up the ticket booths now. Otherwise, our boss is gonna be angry! Okay, fine, boss. We'll stock it up, dude. It only works so fast. I'll get the other one. And if that other dude shows up outside the fence, just greet him like a pleasant, polite customer. Customer. No, I'm gonna punch him in his mouth. Well, he might like that. Probably eat your hand. No, wait, what? See, you're even admitting it now. Nah, dude, it's because you're a watermelon. He probably will confuse you for like a fruit smoothie or something. Bro, I don't want to deal with this man. Then just turn the rides on and have a fun old time. Um, I'm a little bit scared though. It's fine. I'll handle this. Why don't you take a look around the park and make sure there's nothing suspicious anywhere? You're right. You know what? I'm being a coward. Nothing's gonna go wrong, and this is actually gonna be fun. I can't wait to ride the carousel. There you go, Melon. That's the spirit. And now I'll turn on the other rides. See? We're even gonna be rich. I got it, boss. Uh, <laughs> let's let the customers through at, like, midnight for some reason. Why do you look so disgusted and terrified? Also, Melon, I got a question for you. There's a giant red button here that says do not press. Oh, uh, don't press it then, Sonny. Bro, what? That's no problem, boss. We can do that. Cleaning up the trash. Trash piles. Let's go. Melon, one problem with this. Yeah, what's that? How do I clean you up? What do you mean, clean me up? It says to pick up all the trash, but how do I pick you up? Oh, ha, ha, ha. You're calling me trash, Sonny. If anything, you would be a trash because you're literally an incinerator and you burn trash and trash goes to you. Well, that doesn't make me trash. That makes me part of the solution. You're part of the problem. Oh, yeah, fine. You're the garbage bin then, Sonny. <laughs> Thanks. I appreciate Appreciate that. <sighs> but why'd you turn the power out, Melon? I didn't turn the power out. That was clearly you. It's fine. I'm gonna go fix the power. It's back here in storage. I got it. Open this door and activate the power once again. Perfect. Wait, it didn't work. Oh my goodness, what is that? This is what I'm talking about, Sonny. Maybe he's friendly. No. Oh yeah, he's definitely not friendly. Bro, he's gonna eat all of us. No, he's not gonna eat us. He's gonna explode us. I don't know, Sonny. We need to stop this man. He he said he's gonna detonate the ferris wheel, so let's take a look and make sure it's fine. So far, so good. I'll alert the boss, though. Let me give him a quick call on our little telephone. Boss, boss, boss. We got an emergency. This guy is gonna destroy the ferris wheel. It's kind of crazy. <laughs> Dude, all you have to do is say not open today. That's not what we're trying to do. Melanie just wants customers. All his boss wants is to make millions. Dude, I don't blame him. I would want to make millions, too. But gosh darn it, he's got to shut down the park. Uh, I don't think he's going to. He's forcing us to open up the gates to the public. Wait, Melon, good news. The public looks like one guy who's an actual angel, so he's already dead. Wait, so then nothing will matter. Okay, boss, you're finally realizing there's a problem in the park? Yes, that's the least you could do is secure the facilities. Melon, you handle the
that. I'll inspect the carousel. I thought he was gonna hire, like, actual security. Well, that's why he's hired me. Fearless and ruthless and... Oh my gosh, these are horses! Ah, I hate horses! Yeah, Sonny, you are not fearless. You're not gonna do anything about that mouth man. Oh, yeah? What if I force him to drink so much Bloxy Cola that he has a coffee crash? All right, then do it. Oh, I will do it. But first, I'll install some cameras. Same here, Sonny. Hopefully, this should be enough to deter him. Yeah, I get a feeling he won't care too much. Yes, we are, boss. Hard work makes hard people make hard work. Something like that. Hard times make... Uh, I don't know. I don't know, Sonny. Oh, that sounds like a lot of people having fun. That's not people having fun, Sonny. We gotta set up the alarms. Sonny, you gonna help me set up the alarms or am I gonna do it all by myself? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm on it. Give me a second here. I'll install the alarm right in this corner. I got you. Why, thank you. You're so welcome, Melon. I'll even install this alarm right here. Mm, but of course, I will do the same. <laughs> what? All right. Exit signs. You gotta grab them out of storage, Melon. Dude, I thought this was security, not... I don't know whatever this is. Just keep moving. <laughs> Bro, stop! You're so annoying! <laughs> Where are you going? Stop. Stop. You're wasting your time. Stop it, Sonny. Ah, uh, that cost me a hundred Robux and it's gone. Yeah, good job. You're a big old idiot. Whatever. Just put up the exit signs, you scoundrel. They have been deployed. Oh, we got to check the camera footage. I got a bad feeling we're going to see the guy with the big mouth on it. Yeah, I don't like this too much, Sonny. Let's see. Examining the camera footage. No, don't do it. Wait, start running? Why? Uh... Get out of here, Sonny! He's gonna try and kill us! He's right behind you! Run! Where do we go? Where do we go? Where do we go? I'm going straight out, Sonny. I'm done with this job! I'm out of here! Oof! We got out just in time. But then for some reason, we decided to come back again the next day. Boss called us back? I'm starting to feel like this guy is the boss. Yeah, I don't understand. We left, we came back, and now we're calling the SWAT team. Did you say please go call the SWAT or please don't call the SWAT? Clearly it says go call the SWAT. I'm, just, I'm asking what boss said. No, boss wants us to call Schwat. We need your team in here immediately. There's some crazy guy who wants to destroy the theme park. He plans to strike today. We need you. Thank you, SWAT. Melon, just tell me this is all a bad dream. Oh, wait, we're still in the security room. Uh, Sonny, it's not a bad dream. Everything that's happening is totally real, and we're gonna die. Well, I'll check the cameras. <gasps> Bro, he's got dynamite. He's gonna blow up the Ferris wheel. Come on, come on, come on. How do we stop him? We gotta defuse it. I'm not a coward. I'm not gonna run from you, buddy boy. I'm gonna stop him. No, I gotta sound the alarm, Sonny. I've gotta sound the alarms! Where is he? Where is he? I don't know, but I'm out of here, Sonny. I don't wanna die. Bro, I wanna defuse the TNT and save the park. You do that, I'm out of here. Peace! Melon, you couldn't get out. You fell for his trap. Try to run or try to fight. Sonny, I'm sick of running. Me too. It's time for us to hold our ground and fight. Where is he? Where's this monster? I need to grab a gun gun, Sonny. It'll be my only chance. The storage room. Do you think we can get there in time? I don't know. But we've got to try. Make a mad dash for it. I'm doing it, Sonny. I'm doing it! No, I am. I'll handle the villain. I'm not afraid. No, I'm doing it. No, I'm doing it, Sonny. Defeat the carnivore! You shot him! Nice one! Bro, that was so easy. Yep. Then SWAT arrived and secured the park after we defeated the villain. Let's go. And y'all should go head to that subscribe subscribe button right now. Press it in under two seconds to get goaded. One, two, let's go. Today, Sunny and I are playing cart ride around nothing. Yep, we're gonna be spending hours and hours of our lives failing over and over again to never make it to the end. Until we do a little bit of pay to win. That might help us out. Also, goats, comment down below if you beat this game and how to beat this game, because I'm a little bit confused. Sunny, are you ready to do a cart ride around nothing? Bro, this is so much more than nothing. If we can get to the end of the game, we'll claim victory and become the very best that no one ever was. Now drive! 
So I need to, uh, I'm kind of forgetting how to drive this. You know what? I'm getting my own cart. Mal Mal get out of the driver's seat. Sonny, doesn't, does someone have to get in the back? Oh, yeah, we have to turn the generator on. That's why, Sonny. <laughs> Good job turning that bad boy on. Thanks, by the way. Wait, 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 wait. Did you turn it on? Yeah! Steer to shoot. Bro, we could fire off bullets if we need to. Yeah, but we don't need to, Sonny. Dude! I went too fast. I'm sorry. That's it. I'm starting up my bad boy, and I'm moving. All right, you drive this time. You drive. I'll show you how to drive. You gotta be careful on these tracks. My bad, dude. I thought we could go fast. And you slow down. Shoot the wall. Shoot the wall. I shot it, Sonny. Don't you worry. I don't think anything happened there. Except there's another car behind us. Move it, Melon. Oh, no. Oh, no. Slow down. I have slowed. I have slowed, but I gotta go faster than this guy. Maybe maybe nothing will happen if it touches us. It'll probably be fine. Oh, no. It's definitely gonna explode us, Sonny. There's no way. I'll hold it back with my feet. I'll kick it. Come on! And then that little bus just rammed us off the edge. Nice. Bro, how are we supposed to beat this game? It's so hard. Just be patient. We need to look at our available game passes, and we could buy more stability. Want to have a rail magnet and improve the stability of your cart on turns. This game pass is just for you. Oh, yeah. Give me that. I want that. Hold on. Unlock all upgrades without having to complete the game. Oh. <gasps> Every single upgrade. Yeah, you do that, Sonny. I've got the improved stability. That's fine. I'm gonna summon in the golden winner cart. Congratulations, Sonny. You won by not winning. Hope you feel prude to yourself. Look, bro. That's the winner cart. You're just jealous that you don't have it. Yeah. If you actually a winner, Sonny, why don't you meet me at the end? Oh, I won't because I'm already jammed up. I gotta get a new cart. Hey, don't fall off. And it's time to accelerate a little bit up here. Oh, this thing must go fast. Let me try this one. How do I get this out of here, bro? I need to remove these. Bro, I create... Uh, how do I get these things out of here? I'm creating a traffic jam. I don't know, Sonny. Maybe just touch the butts together. I'm ramming it. Oh my gosh. Melon, be careful. Yep, I heard them explode. Sonny, I'm actually making it pretty far right now. I'm not gonna cap. Well, just wait for me. I'm gonna catch up. Wait, no, you have that magnet on your car. I need this. Honestly, I don't think it's doing anything. My cart has almost fallen off so many times. Maybe you need to respawn. What, what just happened to me? Where's my car going? It's leaving me behind. Oh, it's dead. <laughs> that was so weird. Okay, did I get a checkpoint here? You see me up here, Sonny? Hey. Where are you, Melon? I'm right above you. No way, dude. I'm gonna catch up. Good luck with that, Sonny. Speed limit of 10. I don't need luck. Bro, this thing is so slow. Oh, no. I went above the speed limit, and now I'm getting chased by a cop. Stay away. Stay away. Need to slow down. 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 Yeah, one. I wonder if the magnets do stuff. Can I full speed ahead? <laughs> <laughs> the cop just fell off. Nice one, bruh. I'm pretty sure the magnet lets you go full steam ahead. I don't think so, Sonny. I don't know about that. Why don't you just hold W and try it? No, bro. I got so far. It's definitely letting me go faster than normal. I gotta be very careful right now. I don't even know if my magnet's activated. Mine is definitely working. I'm taking some corners a bit faster than I should. <sighs> These tracks are getting sketchy, Sonny. Oh! Holy smokes, I should have flown off there. Don't blow up. No! What just happened? I hit another car. Bruh, you gotta slow down sometimes, Sonny. You know what? I'm putting this to the test. I'm not slowing down. W only. Bruh, I might actually beat the game right now. I'm going crazy. Okay, you were right. The magnet helps, but it's not invincibility. Okay, yep. I need to hit this switch here. Uh, what did that do? Are you kidding me? How did that... <sighs> Why? I'm literally living at spawn. This is my home now. Bruh, how does this switch work? I'm so confusion. Did you actually get a checkpoint though, by the way? No, I didn't, but I, I'm just, I'm on a track that just wants to send me to my death. Oh, that sounds like fun. And I can't get off of it. I think as long as I'm at 20 speed or less, I won't fly off the tracks, I think. Yes, it actually, no, it actually sent me off the track. I was going so slow. Put my engine back on. Engine, come back on, please, please. Are you kidding me? Did you lose? My car
heart got destroyed, Sonny. How? I was going so slow. Maybe that's the problem. You needed to speed up. Yeah, maybe I just needed to pop my flight potion, huh? Maybe that's what I needed to do. How did you get a flying potion? Hey, Sonny. Oh my gosh, I'm spinning uncontrollably right now. Sonny! Sonny, help me! I don't even know where you are. I see you! What are you doing over there? Uh, I don't want to talk about it, bro. No, no, no. My cart is wobbling a lot. It almost fell off the track. Why is it falling off? I didn't even go fast. It's okay, Sonny. I'll save you. Where are you? Uh, Melon, I have an emergency. Hurry! I don't even know where you are. <gasps> Sonny! Sonny, I'll save you! Bro, you're like Santa Claus. You are nothing like Santa Claus. <laughs> Oh my goodness, dude. I'm sorry. It was an accident. You just exploded the both of us. Well, it's okay, Sonny, because I've got a hack that allows us to get an instant win. Yeah, let's see it. <laughs> what is this? How? Where is the end? How did you unlock this? I unlocked it a long, long time ago, Sonny. In a galaxy far, far away. Yeah, I just can't find the ending anywhere. It's not this way. What about way up top there? Is it this thing over here? There's some signs. This looks like the end of the road. Warning, this button changes your team back to starting one. If you try single try badge win, you can permanently persist step for rejoin. Uh, I don't know, Shani. I'm gonna press this button. And I'm gonna press the green one. Let's go. Nothing happened. I don't know what they do. I'm so confused. Well, just take me on another journey. I'll take you away. So far away. And then we'll say... Wait a second, Melon. What about this interior spot way down the track? Where do you see that? What if it's like a hidden factory? Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, let's go in there. Give me a second. That was close, Melon. Uh, Sonny, I'm losing a little bit of control. Yeah, I can see that. Oh my goodness, what is happening? What is happening? Hold on, let me see if you can even get in there. No, it's not looking good. Melon! Melon! Wait, <laughs> Sonny, where did you go? Into the void. I'm falling forever. Dude, I think I sent you flying. Actually, you're right. I'm way above the map. I could see it down there. It's so tiny. No, I'm now falling for real. Goodbye, world. I'm dead. Well, let me just send you flying one more time, Sonny. Yeah, yeah you thought. You thought. And goats, make sure you press that subscribe button right now. Do it quick, because I'm about to send Melon flying. Get over here. Get over here. Yeah. Ah! Nice one. Today, Sonny and I play Don't Get Sniffed. We got trapped in this radiated building, and we have to escape. The only way we can get out of here is if we find the fire extinguisher. But it's not going to be that easy. We're going to have to solve puzzles and find all 14 boogers. All oh, well, this giant foot and nose are trying to sniff us. Can we escape? Stick around to find out. Sonny, whatever you do, don't get sniffed. Just look at him, bro. He's so weird. It's a giant nose vacuum with a top hat. But at least we're super fast. So we can collect those boogers. Yeah, but Melon, his sidekick's here. And it's a giant stinky foot. Dude, keep moving, keep moving. Grab the boogers, grab the key, and dip. I'm right behind you. Just move, move. Get the booger and take cover. You're gonna kill me. You almost killed me by punching me, Sonny. I didn't even mean to hit you. I was trying to grab a booger. Dude, that foot is so quick. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that foot is a villain, bro. He just killed somebody and that was stanky back here. Oh, look, Melon, 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 come back, come back. You missed the booger. Where's the boogie? Boogie, boogie. Melon, stop standing on the boogers or I'll have to punch you. Oh, check this out, Sonny. Number three is blue for me. Sonny, stop. You're gonna get me killed. It's blue for me, too. Just run. Don't look back. Okay, where can we go? Where can we go? This way. This way. I'm following you. Ooh, boogies. Melon. Stop doing that. I told you not to stand on the boogies. We gotta juke him. I need to take cover because I gotta go get that boogie. I couldn't pick it up because Sonny... Someone was standing on it. Oh, wait. I think I have a yellow key. Pretty sure I used this back here. Dodged him. Oh, nope. That's not the yellow key. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. We need to just chill for a bit and make sure we get all the boogers in the hallways. There we go. No! He sniffed me! Good job, Shunny. How do you get sniffed when you're this quick? Because I have to be careful not to punch you. I'm trying to save your life out here. Why don't you just not punch me? Is it that hard? It's the same button as collecting the boogies. Oh, Oh my goodness. That's the problem. Anyways, I got seven boogers now. I've got six. Where'd you get your seventh one from? There was one near the safe zone in the other direction. Let me collect the boogers! 
there! I gotta juke him. No! I got sniffed. That was just sad. Anyways, though, three was blue. That's good. Oh, this foot's gross. Oh, he smells so gross. I need to take cover. Sonny, you wanna meet me back at the safe zone? Not particularly. Okay, never mind then, I guess. I don't know where you are, and I'm kind of lost in these hallways just picking up boogers. So it's every man for themselves now. Maybe we can meet up if we both find the same location. I'm at eight boogies. I'm on eight as well. Oh, number one is green. At least for me it is. And I gotta run quick. I'm gonna try and find the room where there's the three light panels where you put the code in. Oh, I just found that, Sonny. So number three is blue. Why well, is this gonna open? <gasps> I got the code! For me it was green, red, blue. Green, red, blue. Yep, it's not the same for me. Oh, I don't know what the numbers are. The good news is, Melon, you only need to find two colors because then you can just guess the last one. Yes. So I've just gotta find the other ones. And behind that door, there was three boogers. It was insane. Okay. Oh, one is green. One is green. Ha! That's huge, bro. Let me go back. So if one is green and two is red. Nice one. And then head back to the cafeteria. I'll show you where to use this key. And I've got 12 out of 14 boogies. How do you have 12? I've got 11. I don't know, Sonny. I couldn't tell you. Whatever. Just head to the cafeteria. That's where the locked door is where you use the key. Oh, I'm heading to the calf. I'm back there. I found it. Let's go. We need some boogies. Oh, I almost fell in lava. I thought that was a platform. Bro, how did I? What the heck? It's glitching me. No, it's a glass bridge. Oh, you're right. So... <sighs> this is so annoying. That is sad. Did you die? I died, yes. I did die. Pathetic. On the bright side, I found a hammer. Did you find a boogie, though? No boogies, but a hammer that we can use to shred some planks. And I believe the planks, Melon, are located this way. Are you sure about this, Sonny? No, I'm definitely not sure, but I think they're over here. Are you with me? Yes, I'm with you. I know they're very far. Ooh, a boogie. Well, there you go. Now we're tied on boogies. I think it's a left turn here, and then another left shirt. You lead the way now. I found it! See, I I told you I knew. Yeah, you totally knew, Sonny. And then where do we take this plank? I don't know, but I have a feeling we'll need it in the future. Yes, of course we shall. And I believe there's a ladder that we're looking for. Wait, Melon, there's another secret room we have to open up. I remember, but I don't remember where. That's the problem. Bro, and it's not really helping us, is it? Nah, not particularly. Okay, let's just keep running around until we find it. Yep, as long as we stay together, nothing could go wrong. We need to find more keys, bro. There's like four other locks rooms. I'm so lost right now. Yeah, I think you're going in circles. No, not quite, Sonny. Alright, I'll just trust you. Back at the safe zone. Where are you going, Melon? I'm just going somewhere. You're going places, kid. One day you'll be a big deal. Yellow key here. This is a dead end. Brilliant, Melon. Brilliant. And it stinks! That giant foot's here! Uh, Sonny? Uh, I'm very confused. Can I lead the way now? You're really lost. You don't don't know what you're doing. Yeah, I don't, Sonny. I've just been running randomly. Yeah, well, I'm not running randomly anymore. I have a purpose, and it doesn't include you. Wait, I think I found the room. And I found the 13th boogie. Can they get in here? They can get in here, Melon! Sonny, we need the plank. Boom! Boogie acquired. That's 14 boogies and the purple key. Follow me. Sorry, I need to grab this. I need to grab this boogie here. Got it, and time to dip. Gosh darn it, Sonny. You need to follow me. Yeah, but I needed to do something. Where did you go? I found the purple dog. Oh, I gotta dip, I gotta dip, I gotta dip. Whatever, dip a chino, I'll find it myself. Where are you, Sonny? I am totally lost now. No, I'm not. Purple door, let's go. Yep. And now we got the key card. And luckily for you, I know where the key card lies. No way. You have this memorized? How do you understand this maze so well? I don't really. I just gotta find the safe zone and I kind of know where it is. Ish. Hey, I actually found it. Let's go. No way. Swipe that key and go through. We have all the boogers we need. And now we just need to find the fire extinguisher. Yes, this is quite tricky to jump when you're going really quick with it. Just saying. Yes, indeed. And we have the 14 boogers required. Collect the yellow key. I know where this door lies. Do you actually remember? Yeah, I think I kind of remember the rough idea of where it is. I just gotta find the potato painting. Yeah, you're right. It's at a dead end next to that guy with the pimples on his potato face. This is not the right dead end? Incorrect decisions, Melon. I thought you were better than this. Sonny, I don't completely know where this painting 
painting is. I just have a little bit of an idea. There it is. I found him. Nicely done. Now, we've got the fire extinguisher. All that's left to do is make the great... Oh, the escape was not that corner. Oh, no. I don't want to get stankied on either. I'll race you to the escape. Whoever gets out first wins. Oh, yeah? Well, then I guess I need to split up to give myself a chance. Ah! Where's the escape? Please be down this hallway. Is that it? Is that the great... Nope, that is not the great escape. Dang it. That was just the key card. I can do this. I can beat you out of here. No, you can't, Sonny. No, you cannot. Oh, yeah? Watch me thrive. It's right around this corner. Let's go, baby. No! I knew it! Dang it! I am the goat champion, my friend. I cannot believe it. Once I saw the purple door, I knew where it was. That was a close one. At least we sealed in that stanky foot. Wait, why are we getting arrested? No! Whatever. That was awesome. And if you guys enjoyed this one, please press the like button and subscribe. Also, stick around for the rest of this epic movie, because we're about to play Don't Get Licked. Today, Sonny and I are facing off in the most important game of all time. It's called Roblox Card Battles. The rules are simple. Fire beats ice, ice beats water, and water beats fire. So, who will win in this ultimate mind game and prove who is the smartest of all time? Obviously, it's gonna be your boy, Melon. Oh, Sunny Sensei, I need to achieve my yellow belt. That's right, I am the Sensei, Melon Chun. And I'll never let you take the yellow belt from me. I'm the GOAT at this game. Undefeated, undisputed champion of the cards. You wanna go? Let's do it then. I'll take that belt right off you. Hold on. Let me customize my deck because I want to be too cold. Why would you want to be too cold, Sonny? Okay, I'm ready. It's time for you to die. That's what you think. That is what you think. If you're too cold, well, then I'm too colder. Yeah, right. I don't believe it. Ow, I told you. No way. Die. How could I be outplayed and outmaneuvered like that? That was crazy. And this time, Sonny, I'll be even colder. No way. <laughs> Get played. I'm bouncing you on that trampoline. Why would fire make me bounce on a trampoline and land on my face? Bro, don't question it, dude. Oh, is he summoning the water here? What is he doing? I don't even know what this card is. I'm actually very confused. That's cap. That's cap. I am so confused right now, Sonny. No way. How do you have that? Die. Uh, I'm getting destroyed. And this time you will die completely. I completely disagree. Why? You know I have the big ice cards. Not anymore. I'm the coldest in the game. I told you, bro, I'm too cold. You want to be too cold? I promise you I'm colder, Sonny. I promise you I'm colder! Yeah, right. How do you have that again? Let's go! All right, I lost. That is pitiful. I'm embarrassed. I'm really embarrassed. Uh, 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 let's go. I'm the goat. Uh, I'm the goat. Gonna take that yellow belt. Whatever, broski. I gotta do some shopping now to make that right. Yeah, Sonny, all of my cards have a power level of six to nine. That's ridiculous. But I think that's lame. I'm just gonna equip every single one of my cards. Can we make that a new rule? Oh, that's interesting. Very interesting. I really want the spicy wings, though. Oh, I have those, Sonny. Pretty cool. What about... The igloo. Bro, you got the igloo from this? Bro, the fire mallow. Look at that little marshmallow boy. Swaps cards. Dang, that's cool. I'm spending 12,000 gems. Give me that tsunami. Give me that tsunami. I got it. Let's go. No way. Bro, that is so unfair. I'm spinning a wheel right now, though. Come on. OP card. Oh, never mind. Pick a card to upgrade. Yes, I need more. Oh, it's maxed out. Never mind. Ooh, I want some of these. Invisi Cloak redraws three random cards from both players. Whoa, what is this? Moves all collected snow elements from the opponent. Dude, this is awesome. I want some of these. For 1,000 Robux, I could get these extra special cards. Wait, what are you doing? Give me these cards. They have unique abilities, Sunny. If I have fog, removes all collected snow. How do you get more spells? That's what I'm trying to figure out. I have no idea, Sunny. But I'm down to face off again. Me too. But give me one second, Melon. There's something I want to do. Yes. That's exactly what I require.
fire. And this. Yes, because I am the richest in the game. Let's see what we get, goats. Come on, give me the bubble gum. Are you kidding me? <sighs> Whatever, they're still kind of cool. Well, Melon, I'm ready. Where even are you? Oh, I'm just being chilling. I have no idea where you are, Sonny. I'm gonna equip this so I can fart in your face. Look, I'm right here. And peep my belt, bro. Bro, you have a sunny belt? That's so lame. What are you talking about? It's awesome. Now stop moving so I can challenge you. No, I've challenged you, Sonny. You're going down, Melon Chun. Oh, I'm in your head, brother. You don't know what's about to happen to you. Yeah, you'll never expect this. Oh, but I did. Are you kidding me? I've gone ice fishing for boots. Yep, you got nothing there, Sonny. I don't really understand how that's ice, but I'll take it. There's no way you'd be cold like that. You're probably using fire, which means I should apply some water, which means I should actually apply ice because you're probably using water. Are you sure about that, Sonny? No way! I just have the stronger version. What is this? There's no way you would do three ices. You're not that cold. And now that I've applied my fog ability, I know that you have no more ice cards, which means I'm free to play a high water card. No! But I've got higher! Get out of here. I should have played ice. Ice is not nice. That's it, Sonny. I didn't want to have to do this to you. Do what? Yeah! Ow! How could you, Melon? That was not cool. And now all that's left to do is secure the Dubberton. I don't think so. Thinks he's getting the Dubberton, which means I must do this. What did you do? Oh my goodness, we tied, Sonny. That's right. There's no way I will let you win. I will win, Sonny! No! You haven't played one water card. Not true. I played one. That's why I have a point. Oh, wait. Yeah, you're right, actually. It's a good point. Bro, what do I do? What do I do? He's playing water, isn't he? Oh, but I am. But I am watermelon style. Bro, I am trash. What happened to me? I'm in your head right now, Sonny. I'm in your head. I used to be so good. And guess who got their yellow belts? Oh, you did too, actually. And Sonny, I look good with it. I can't lose three in a row. That'd be impossible, right? You want to bet, Sonny? I'm going to close my eyes and choose. Da, 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 da. What did I pick? Oh my goodness, Sonny. No. Why? <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Close my eyes again. Believe in the heart of the cards. Believe. I believe in the heart of the farts. Oh, double whammy. You lost your water too. Dang it, bro. You gave me a hot cup of tea. Drink that tea and burn. Uh, you might think I've lost my water, Sonny, but maybe I haven't lost my water. You've lost the way, Melon. You've lost the way. Yeah? Did I? Did I really? You did. Oh, dang it. That's right. You can't beat a niner. Oh, but I'm about to. I'm about to right here. Nah, you playing ice. Are you kidding me? Why? Yes, I can finally surf. I don't like getting surfed on. Oh, you fail. Try it again. I just dare you. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Why? You told me to try it again, Sonny. How do you keep outsmarting me? Because I got the biggest brain. Out of all the brains there ever been a brain for, I have it. It's big. What? Yeah. What? Are you okay? You know what I just said, Sonny. Thank you. Ah! I finally have done it. I have outsmarted the melon. You think so, Sonny, do you? Indeed, I do. The question is, would I dare do something quite like this? Oh. Oh, but would I dare doing something quite like, oh, you want the ice, but I cannot allow you to have the ice because if you had the ice, oh, but that's how you're double whamming me because you're doing the fire now. Oh, yes. But you think that would stop me from popping a power up spell and playing a higher fire card? Oh, no. You just farted on me. That's disgusting. Boom. And now I have water or ice. Which one am I going to play? Obviously water, bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you fell for it! I didn't pick either! Are you kidding me? I'm actually getting outsmarted by a stinking watermelon! How many melon seeds did you activate? Too many, Sonny, and the Dubberton is assured. No! Not yet it's not! Get that Dubberton out of here! Oh no, you could actually win now! I'm just picking a card at random. I don't believe that for a second. Oh, do you not believe such a thing? No! Let's 
Let's go! I knew I should have played ice. I did it. I finally bounced back. The victory is all mine. Now, Melon, whoever wins the next round will be crowned the goat. All right, Sonny. It's time for me to win. Yeah, I just want to get this stuff off my screen. It's kind of annoying. Hold on. Oh, that is trash. The snowman would have been cool. Oh, I have a free spin. Hold on. I want something. Oh, never mind. That's right. No spins for you. Hey, Melon. Oh, you're too easy, bro. You're putting me to sleep. <laughs> You think I'm putting you to sleep? I'm so cool, I'm gonna win. Yeah, right, dude. Watch this. I'll use something super weak to beat you on the fr Oh. Yeah, should've used something a little stronger now, shouldn't ya? Dang it. I will not allow that insolence to happen again, though. Are you sure about that? <laughs> Oh, I used a weak water to counter your fire. Used a remove. You removed a what? How? What is that? That's right, Melon. You thought you were hot stuff. You're so annoying. I'm blocking you from using spells. And I'm freezing you. You're such a cheeser. It's not even funny. I'm not a cheeser, bro. I'm smarterer. Now, the question is here. What is the optimal maneuver? I predict this is quite optimal, actually. I predict this is optimal. Ha <laughs> ha! Why would you play that and think it was smart? Now, let me see something. Let's use this. Confiscate. I confiscated something from you. Now, what did you take from me? I don't know, but I did it. I did it, Sonny. Dang it! And I got you frosty. I thought maybe if I just kept playing water, I would win. And maybe, Melon, just maybe, if I wait a little longer, just a little longer, one more second exactly, and voila! Bro, how many of those do you have? And now you want to counter me, I counter you. Dude, you're actually such a troll, it's not even funny. And then I secure the Dubberton like this. He's so annoying, bro. You're actually so annoying. I'm just smarter than you, and I have to prove it. I have to prove it. You're just a cheeser. That's all you are at the end of the day. Burn! Burn! I hope you feel good about yourself, Sonny. You completely cheated. Dude, you didn't even get to three waters anyways. You have zero of them. Yes, I did! I had two! Twice! That's unlucky. You took away two of my waters, bro. I am the champion, my friend. Bow, bow. You want one more try? You want one more try, huh? Yeah, I want to destroy you, Sonny. No more of those stupid, stinking spells. I can't promise nothing. It's all part of the video game. Oh, that was a quick selection, Melon. Are you sure about that? I get a quick Dubberton here. I'm, I'm positive, dude. All right. Here's, a, here's an L for you. Nice ice. Oh, you're so smart, Tony. Nice. Dang it. I thought you picked your niner, the igloo. You are a fool by the end of the day. It's so obvious. Not again! Oh, what's this? You can read like a book. Surely, surely I wouldn't. Dude, stop! <laughs> How many of those do you have? It's not even fair. Oh, uh, it feels quite fair to me. So annoying. I have a suspicious feeling that you're doing this. Mm-hmm. Oh, do you now? Are you kidding me right now? No, now I'm going here and I'm blocking you. No more of that. And now at the last second I switch it up. No, you don't. You play another water. I already know it. Uh oh, am I? Am I? <laughs> this is really bad. And now I play something that you least suspect. Fire? Ice? Water? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do is the question. I don't know what play, but I would style on you if I beat you with this. Bruh. That's the safest bet. Yes. Bro, I could have won. I could have played a nine water and wrecked you. Okay, we're good. We're good. That was the safest play in the book. Now I just played the even safer play. Did you just lock in a big water? Oh, did I? Oh, did I, Sonny? Tell me, did I? Did I lock in a big water? See, if I do this, I probably lose, but I don't lose the game. Oh, this is tricky. Oh, my God. Oh, 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 oh. What did I do, Sonny? What did I do? Oh, you fell for it. Ruh -roh. Any win I get is a dub for me. That's what you think. If I can just choose wisely, I can secure the Dobberton. Let me just play my nine card real quick. Oh, this is rough. I don't know which one it is. Is it a water? Is it an ice? Please tell me it's water. No! Dude, you're so annoying, brah. Let's see who wins this, shall we? Oh, we shall indeed. What did he select? 
liked this melon. Could he really be that devious? I don't think so. I divide the deviousness with deviousness. Nothing shall occur. I need another redraw, yes. No, I'm still blocked. Okay, I can wait. I can wait. Can you wait? You're kidding me. <laughs> Power up. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is optimal. No! And I win. Dang it. I admit it. You're the better player at cards. Let's go. And you goats can be the best subscribers by pressing that button now.